Kendra Bishop here with the Bishop Real Estate Group, and I am here for our monthly market update. It is April 2020, and I am coming at you from my home office as I shelter in place and wanted to give you some information of what's happening in the market, what are the current trends, how is the shelter in place affecting real estate, and what we predict will happen in the weeks and months to come as uh, orders start to lift around the region. So first and foremost, obviously we all went into shelter in place mid-March, schools got shut down in the region March 13th. A week later, the governor issued the shelter in place orders that affected all of us. And at the beginning, real estate was not considered essential business. And so we immediately went virtual in everything that we are doing today. Uh, we've had some changes along the way. We have become essential with some very strict guidelines but we are still very different county to county as far as what we can and can't do. And I'll talk about that in a few minutes. But with those virtual um, showings and with the market needing to go completely virtual, we've still done okay. Uh, since the shelter in, orders, um, shelter in place orders went into effect, um, our listings are down just 25%. Uh, pendings are down about 35%, so a little bit steeper. But when we look at the market from a year ago uh, to right now, listings from a year ago are down 32%. So we are seeing the market is still moving. Uh, and in some of that 32% are folks that have taken their houses off the market that don't wanna show them during these times. So we are seeing the market moving. We are still seeing houses go pending and go into escrow and close escrow, um, even with needing to do the entire transaction remotely, which is pretty fascinating and exciting for us. The one market that we're seeing a lag in is the jumbo market, and it's causing a little bit of pause and concern. Uh, jumbo financing went through some pretty uh, large changes uh, in early March as well as um, the financial market started to have some concern. And it's much harder to get jumbo financing today um, in some of the not typical platforms. And so because of that, we have seen a slowdown in the higher end market. And that will be one that we're gonna to need to continue to keep an eye on. We're gonna to need to watch. We're going to see what transpires in the next couple of weeks and months um, and see if inventory starts to improve. We have seen an uptick in the last 10 days or so um, in showings and activity and pendings in our higher end market. So we're hoping that that's a trend that shows that people are starting um, to feel okay with the new normal and that we'll continue to see uh, positive gains in that marketplace. But overall, you know, we're seeing things um, all over the place. We're getting calls from those of you that are losing your businesses or struggling, your businesses are shut down, you're going through really tough financial times, and our hearts go out to you for that because we know that this is very, very tough on many. We're also in contact with, with buyers and sellers who are taking advantage of the marketplace, buyers that are thrilled with the low interest rates and are seeing multiple offers on, on properties. Um, we're seeing sellers who are wanting to sell now in right size during the summer months um, before the fall market and before school hopefully kicks back in, in fall. So we are seeing um, across the board some folks more concerned with the economy, some folks not really concerned with the economy. It's really a case-by-case -case basis. What do we expect that will happen? We are anticipating a very, very busy summer. We are anticipating that once the shelter in place orders are lifted, uh, that we will see a tremendous amount of inventory come to market, that we will see a lot of movement in this marketplace. All of the signs are showing that we've got inventory ready to come to market. We've got buyers and sellers anxious to move forward. And we're really anticipating a strong, strong summer into the fall marketplace. So as always, we are here for you. We hope that you are all staying healthy, that you are staying happy with your loved ones, that you're hopefully a little bit enjoying this extra family time that we're all getting together. And if we can ever be a resource for you, personally, professionally, whatever that may be, please pick up the phone. We'd love to hear from you. Call us, email us, text us, DM us on social media. We'd love to hear how you are and how we can be a support of you in the market. Until next month, uh, stay healthy, and hopefully I have new and different news as we get to mid to late May, uh, and we're in a different place in the market. Stay healthy. Bye-bye.